136 kilometers faced by the riders as they took the starter's gun today at the head of them. Reigning world champion Elisa Balsamo. 24 teams in total of six riders. 14 of them at world tour level. Eight sections of Sterato, totaling over 31 and a half kilometers on the white uh, roads, the challenging roads. Some of the early attacks in the final, the early break of two having been retained, it was left down to the heavy hitters. And the big names, including Lotte Kopecky, who launched a speculative effort at the penultimate section of white roads. She was joined by some of the biggest names, including two-time winner of Strada Bianca from the Movistar squad, Annemiek van Vluten, Mariana Voss, safely nestling in the lead group as well. Others starting to feel the pinch as the miles and the kilometers started to take their toll. It was Annemiek van Vluten who wanted to try and stretch the group thin. And she drew Lotte Kopecky clear on the final sector of White Roads. Those two proving the strongest with 10 kilometers remaining though, just too far from the line and enough strength left behind to close it down. Lisa Longa Borghini among those who managed to fight their way back into contention as we approach the final 900 meters. It was Annemiek van Vluten who went for glory. Kopecky once more able to live with her and it was Kopecky that led into the final bend and she took the greatest victory of her career, vanquishing a two-time winner of Strada Bianca. Lotta Kopecky of the SD Works squad, the Belgian national road race champion, taking the victory. A 1-3 finish for SD Works with Ashley Mulman pazio following Annemiek van Vluten across the line. A victory she could hardly believe, but that she had fought for. And the Belgian national road race champion colors, taking glory in Piazza del Campo. <laughs> Come back, 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 come back,